A lot of you asked how I made the chemical I showed in my last video, so today I'm going to explain it as fast as I can. Now the first thing you want to do is dissolve some acetanilide in a mixture of sulfuric acid and acetic acid. You then add fuming nitric acid dropwise which will nitrate acetanilide at the para position. The intermediate product is paranitroacetanilide which is precipitated by pouring into cold water and vacuum filtered. The now somewhat dry product is transferred to a flask and boiled with 70% sulfuric acid which will hydrolyze the paranitroacetanilide to paranitroaniline. Paranitroaniline is soluble in its protonated form, so when this clears up it's done, and can then be basified with 3 molar sodium hydroxide. This deprotonates the paranitroaniline, reducing its solubility so that it can be collected again by filtration. However, this product is crude and still contains a lot of the meta and ortho isomers which need to be removed by recrystallization from hot methanol. These crystals are filtered one final time, allowed to dry, and then I'm done. Now for those of you who are interested, I included the reaction mechanisms at the end if you'd like to give them a look. Also, if you're curious why I didn't just nitrate aniline, it's because the amine group on aniline is very easily protonated in the nitrating mixture. This protonated amine acts as a meta-director forming metanitroaniline, which we don't want. The acetyl group of acetanilide, however, acts as a paradirector which massively increases the yield. Anyway, as always, I hope you found this video interesting, and if you want to see more science, consider giving me a follow.